And you can see the grammar contingent on the left of your screen. The hardy souls. And on the other side of the field, this is the scene. King's College, Francis Manulelua. It's a weird thing to say, Jeff, but the side that settles quickly normally ends up winning as well because you've got to just remove the emotion. Once you've walked out through this parade and then the huckers are done, you just need to focus on what's at hand, and that is the challenge of trying to make sure that you can win this particular game. 211 matches, the first back in 1896. Grammar with 135 wins to Kings, 60, 16 draws. Kings College established 1896, their first 1A title back in 1908. And their last in 2019. Such a storied rivalry. No school has produced more All Blacks than Auckland Grammar. 51 players coming from Auckland Grammar to go on to play for the All Blacks. A proud school. They won the first eight Auckland 1A titles when the competition kicked off back in 1895. And Willie Lowe say when people watching in from around the world, and we welcome the old boys from both of these schools that will be tuned in for this. This moment right here, this moment right here, these haka is what First 15 Rugby in this country is all about. Well, it's unique to New Zealand, but it's also unique to these schools who have really embraced the te reo side of New Zealand. And to stand there and not actually perform the haka is really unusual for these players because they're relying on their schoolmates to do it for them, to set down the challenge. And this is a spine-tingling moment. Some of the All Blacks to come out of Auckland Grammar. Former All Blacks captain Wilson Winner, A. Cal Tremaine, Grant Fox, to name a few.
there's the challenge from Auckland Grammar. And now the turn of the home side, King's College. King's College standing as one behind their team who will look for their first win over Auckland Grammar, Willie Lose since 2019. Yeah, special moment though, and I love the way that they've incorporated the wahine, the women from the King's College School. They used to all be at one side, now they actually spread them and have them on the edges with the tane with the men in front of them. It is special. And the introduction of the drum as well just kept them in time.